Good morning, I'm Mike Sands with your sports report. Well, Ole Miss men's basketball coming off perhaps their most significant victory in a number of years. Saturday's blowout of then 10th ranked Missouri. And last night, the Rebels on the road at Vanderbilt seeking a 3-0 start in the SEC. And Andy Kennedy looking to lead Ole Miss to that first 3-0 SEC start. The Rebels first since 2006. Action early in the first half, Ladarius White on the turnaround jumper. However, it'd be the Commodores who'd come out with the hot hand. Rod Odom with the Vanderbilt three. Coming up down the other end, Rebels go inside. Murphy Holloway to Reginald Buckner on the alley-oop jam. And later in the first half, Marshall Henderson on the drive. Long striding lay-in. Now fast forward to the final 10 seconds of the second half. We are tied at 75. Kedron Johnson kicks it to Kevin Bright for the corner three. Doors up three with just seconds to go. Looks like it's going to spoil a huge comeback in the final minutes for the Rebels, who have to go without a timeout. But Marshall Henderson, bang, and from 35 feet at the horn to force overtime. And Ole Miss holds Vandy to a single point in the extra period. Ole Miss wins at 89-79. Meanwhile, Mississippi State off to a surprising 2-0 start in SEC play, looking to join the rival Rebels at 3-0 tonight when they host Alabama. Uh, happy with the way our guys are playing. Um, I know it was crazy when we lost to Alabama A&M, but I actually thought that we got better um, during that time period and it's uh, starting to show in results as far as wins. Um, the thing we want to see is I understand that Alabama is, is a huge rival for us second probably behind Ole Miss and we love to see the fans come out and support these kids and and fight with us and I'm looking forward uh, to a raucous crowd in the hump coming up here. Tip off between the Bulldogs and Crimson Tide 8 o'clock tonight in Starkville and that's going to do it for your morning sports now back to you.